Prophecy Sun. This is my daughter, Owl, and this piece is called Relic Dreaming. It's about technology and the relationship of motherhood and uh, to be, it's, it's very basic in its simplicity, but it, uh, its simplicity is supposed to hold a lot of power. I had an idea of what I wanted to do with the piece, but it wasn't until I actually uh, came and saw the space then I started to really respond to the space and the size, the shape, and um, it's a very exciting process. She likes it too. <laughs> well, we're working on the outdoors, that's one, co one consideration. Um, second consideration is the lighting, and the third consideration is uh, the fact that there's interaction with different people. And um, because of this, the way this piece is, there's all of these sort of quote-unquote people or beings attached to each other. And over on the left-hand side, there's a small projection, very small and intimate, up on the roof. And um, originally I had thought that I would have it projecting in the back, but the spaces, it didn't seem right. So I was really affording, um, affording my reactions to that. The second thing is, is the, the way the weather and the outdoor space, it really changes the way that you interact with the piece. The balloons will fly all over the place. <laughs> so I've had to contain them a little bit. Uh, the first two days, it was a little bit of an experiment to sort of see what I would do. Um, and uh, yeah, so it's, it's, it's an evolving piece because the balloons are popping every day. There's more and more popped. And so you can kind of move a little bit more into the space. And hopefully by the end of the week, uh, you'll be able to actually walk fully into the container. I normally would show inside gallery spaces, um, installations that have a lot more of a controlled environment, um, uh, where I can really control the projection, the, the lighting, the sound. In this space, it, it afforded me different ways and different angles of, of approaching the project. I feel a little more carefree about it. I, I actually would like to work more with spaces like this because it's a very unique unique space. There's challenges with it, but it's also um, it's a, an amazing thing to have it in an outdoor landscape. You have a potential of really doing anything in this space. Another part of this piece that I think is really important is uh, its, reaction, its relationship to the other artists. Um, the other container artists here were all from very different backgrounds, um, but we all are viewing technology in different ways. Uh, this piece is about the simplicity of technology and air. Air is a very basic thing. We all breathe it, um, but from a very early age, uh, to, to have a relationship... Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's probably good. She just smacked me pretty good. That's okay. She didn't mean it. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's, mm, that might be it for me. I think I'm leaning. Okay, yeah. Okay. Is that okay? You've done the crazy stuff? You've done it? Yeah. Have you done this?